tonight. The following contest is for one fall with a 20 minute time limit and it's a three way dance. Making his way to the ring right now. He's all from Paradise City, USA. Weighing in tonight at 201 pounds. The New Deal. And. Oh. Three way action here at Challenge of Champions 4, and you see. The New Deal, Dan Walsh on his way to ringside, a very popular young athlete here in Gateway Championship Wrestling. Former light heavyweight champion looking to climb back up those rankings. A win here tonight could go a long way. He's a man that's on that borderline as far as weight goes. He could with a few more pounds wrestling that heavyweight division, and I think he's a good contender there too. But certainly this battle will be critical in moving up whatever ladder he wants to climb. I got 99 pounds, but a bitch. His opponent, weighing in tonight at 180 pounds, he held from Clint Hill, Missouri, Michael Sudia. And you see on his way to the ring, the youngster, Michael Sirius, who has been so impressive since joining the full-time ranks of Gateway Championship Wrestling. And this match is also pivotal for him. He's been getting a, a good one-loss record together, but he really hasn't had uh, very many opportunities at championship matches or high-profile matches. And a win here, you would think, would launch him into that type of uh, environment. No question about it. People are still talking about that Pride of St. Peter's match that he won earlier this year. We'll see if he can follow up on that. Well, Walsh is in the ring. Sirius is in the ring. And here comes and the, the third competitor. Contestant. Weighing in tonight at 90 kilos, he hails from the whole continent of Europe. He's a self-proclaimed European legend, Pierre Abernathy. Here's your favorite wrestler. Uh, anything is far from it. There he is, the self-proclaimed European legend, Pierre Abernathy. And what in the Sam Hill is that behind him? Long time friend, they just wrestled last week in Mount Vernon. Well, it did appear in that match in Mount Vernon that these two ended up being somewhat uh, kindred spirits, having a lot more in common. And quite frankly, it scares me half to death that anyone would have anything in common with Pierre Abernathy. But there he is, his new uh, confidant, if you will, Yvonne Petrie. And I know I called him Evan Petrie last week. Believe me, he ripped me a new one for that. He is very adamant that the proper pronunciation of his first name is Yvonne. Whatever. And they're endearing themselves to the fans of ringside once again. Well, Yvonne Petrie and Pierre Abernathy. Why does it feel like I have phlegm in my throat whenever I say those names? Well, if this is what the European Union gives to the world, I want no part of it. Your political leanings are showing again, Travis. Well, it's kind of hard not to with these two out here. Abernathy and Petrie on their way to the ring. And, and why is Petri even out here? This is not a tag team match. This is a three-way singles match between Pierre Abernathy, Michael Sirius, and the New Deal, Dan Walsh. Come on, I know you spent a vacation or two in France. <laughs> if I did, I wouldn't admit it. Well, finally, Pierre Abernathy is in the ring took him long enough. You know, something about this guy just makes my skin crawl. I, I can't put, put my finger on it. I'll agree with you on that one. Well, away we go. All three of these guys, no doubt, looking for that big win that will catapult him up the rankings. As I said, Walsh, former title holder. We got Michael Sirius, who's 
picked up a few impressive victories. He's looking for that, perhaps that one big win that'll get him over the hump, so to speak. And of course, Pierre Abernathy, who claims to have a lot of high profile wins across the continent of Europe, none of which have been substantiated through research, though. That's the, the odd part about the whole thing. Claiming he was Maltese heavyweight champion at one time. Again, not documented anywhere. Claiming to have dominated the Faroe Islands at one point. What the heck is Zivan Petrie doing out there? Hold on. I think his shorts might be on too tight. I had to get on here and say something. Is it just me, or is this guy and his tag team partner more flame broiled than a Burger King hamburger? What is he insinuating? What we're all thinking. You know, I just heard this guy walk around and talk about how much he hates Americans because we're so ugly or we're just so stupid. Have you seen that guy's teeth lately? Bad hygiene is underestimating it. Your mouth looks like there's a gang fight happening inside of it. And you know what, just like many times, just like many times in our history, it looks like USA is going to have to whoop a little bit of European ass. Apparently not many dentists in the continent of Europe. Well, oh yeah, and by the way, Jerry Lewis sucks. Well, away we go. And Dan Walsh giving us his commentary. Pierre electing to start the match on the outside of the ring. You know, Dan Walsh with that great military background of his, and this is one time in history that the American military will not be bailing out the French. Again, again your political leanings are showing. Um, obviously, Dan Walsh uh, no doubt will be infuriated by some of the comments that Pierre Abernathy has made about the United States. Well, here we go. It is Dan Walsh in the ring, Michael Sirius in the ring. Abernathy and his uh, companion on the floor. Not that there's anything wrong with companionship. Colin Obo tie up now, Sirius. Underneath goes by, great binds the leg, takes him down. Nice ride from Michael Sirius into the hammerlock. This great, where, great scientific wrestling by this young man. This is where Sirius is going to have an advantage if he can turn it into a mat wrestling competition here. Look at this. Look at that. Rolls through the hammerlock. Gets two. Version of a three-quarter Nelson, I believe. Going into a front chancery now. Cover now. Count of one, two while cripping the neck. But Seen, Siri, it's going to work now. Seeing some tremendous mad exchanges here in the early going. And conspicuous by his absence is the European scum, I mean legend, Pierre Abernathy. He and his partner have a front row seat, but Pierre's a part of this match. He hasn't been in it yet. Rolls through, count of two. It's serious on the defensive now as Dan Walsh maintains a headlock. Walsh probably has the advantage in upper body strength over both of these athletes. Serious, the advantage on the technical wrestling side. And Abernathy, the advantage on, well, I'm not sure what Pierre Abernathy has the advantage on, come to think of it. Well, he's got some... He's got some friends on the, uh, he's got a friend on the outside, no question about that. Count of two once again from Abernathy. Pierre trying to sneak in the back door and steal one. Didn't quite turn out that way. You know, Patrick, I think that's the most unintentionally funny thing you've ever said. <laughs> I'm just now realizing that, yeah. Now to the floor, here comes Walsh. Whoa, wait a second. He has found Petri and is stomping a mud hole in him. Serious going to work now. On Abernathy. These two have finally decided to just go to work on Pierre and Devon. And Sirius on the outside launches Abernathy back into the ring. Having a hard time following all this action. Sirius now back in the ring with Abernathy. Abernathy fires back. Snap mirror. And now Walsh on the floor. Hello. 
Huh? Abernathy back on the inside. Kick to Snap the snap mirror. So a kick to the spine a little earlier. Pierre could be setting up for another one here. There is action occurring all over the building here in Overland at the Challenge of Champions 4. All you know what is breaking loose in this international incident. And right now, Pierre has control on Michael Sirius. Dan Walsh is on the outside working over Ivan. Boy, the patriotism in this arena is palpable right now as Abernathy with that neck vice on Michael Sirius. And right now, Walsh working over Petrie on the outside. This one Irish is. Irish whip. This one's just all over the place. Abernathy now with a boot right to the throat. Referee trying to get that broken up while Walsh continues to pound away on Petrie on the floor. <laughs> This is quite the auspicious debut for Yvonne Petri. <laughs> no question about that. If we got legal participants in the ring right now. Pierre, like, perhaps setting up a superplex. Walsh ran Petri into the corner, or into the guard wire, rather. Sirius launching Abernathy off the ropes. And now it's Sirius on the top rope. High in the air is Michael Sirius. Diving headbutt, and he connected. He may have knocked himself silly there. Walsh going in to take advantage. Count of two, and that's it. Walsh was an opportunist right there. You've got to be that in a three-way match. Remember, it is one fall, so you can't just lay back and wait for a pinfall to occur. Walsh now has him hooked up. Could be looking to finish him off. There it is, the Dantastic. Hooks a leg. Count of one, count of two, count of three. Having girl problems, I feel bad for you. And here's your Dan Walsh maintaining the pride of the United States of America in this three-way match. And one for good measure on Petrie. 